local port forwarding allows us to tunnel traffic from our host through an intermediate or a proxy and have that traffic continue on to some destination host. This is useful when we can't reach the destination, but the intermediate host can. There's two different scenarios. There may be some port on the intermediate host that we would like to connect to, but it's blocked by a firewall. However, we can SSH to that host and then reach the port through the SSH tunnel. By extension, the intermediate host might have access to some far reaching host that we just can't get to from our position, but we can tunnel the traffic to the intermediate and let it pass the traffic on to the destination. So let's take a look at an example. Here we have a client machine. We also have a Windows server, and the Windows server happens to be at IP.10. And we have a web server whose IP is .33. So from our position on the network, we can't reach the web server, but the intermediate host, the Windows server, can. So here's how we would use local forwarding to connect. So we use the dash L for local port forwarding. And then we want to specify the local system and port and the remote system and port. So the local system in our case is 127.0.0.1, and we're going to use port 80. And the ultimate destination we want to reach was that web server on dot 33. And it's also running on port 80. Now we need to connect to the intermediate host. And we do this like we would with any SSH connection. We log in. So now we have a standard SSH connection to the Windows host. And furthermore, any traffic that we send to localhost port 80 will go through the intermediate host at dot 10 and be routed on to dot 33. If we take a look at our netstat, we'll see that we have a connection listening on local port 80 now. So here we have that connection listening on our local host for port 80. So we'll start up Firefox and we'll browse to the site accessible on localhost. And we see that we get the Apache web page for the server, and then we can browse normally through the SSH channel to that web server running on .33.